The union cabinet chaired by Prime Minister Narendra Modi has approved 7,280 crore scheme to promote domestic manufacturing of centered rare earth permanent magnets. This is India's first initiative aimed at building a fully integrated rare earth permanent magnet ecosystem. The scheme includes 6,450 crore rupees in sales linked incentives over five years, 750 crore rupees in capital subsidy for five selected manufacturers, a total plant capacity of 6,000 MTPA, with each beneficiary allotted up to 1,200 MTPA, a seven year duration, including a two year gestation period for setting up facilities. Both public and private players from sectors like electronics, automobiles, and steel can participate through a global bidding process. The government aims to make India self-reliant in rare earth magnet manufacturing within three to four years, aligning the initiative with India's semiconductor and critical minerals mission. China controls nearly 90% of the global rare earth magnet market, giving it enormous geopolitical leverage. Recent Chinese tightening of export norms has disrupted global supply chains, including for Indian EVs and electronics manufacturers. India holds 6.9 million tons of rare earth deposits, yet lacks refining, separation, and magnet production capacities, areas dominated by China. The scheme aims to build domestic capability across all stages, reducing import dependence and insulating Indian industries from geopolitical shocks. Experts note that this intervention arrives at a time when rare earths have become a bargaining chip in US-China negotiations, making India's entry into the sector strategically essential. Rare earth permanent magnets are critical components in electric vehicle motors, wind turbines, consumer electronics like smartphones and laptops, aerospace and defense systems including fighter jets, industrial machinery and robotics. India's annual demand is 4,000 to 5,000 tons and consumption is expected to double by 2030. Today, almost all magnets are imported, creating a strategic vulnerability. An integrated domestic magnet manufacturing base can strengthen India's energy security and clean mobility goals, reduce crude oil import dependence, bolster defense and advanced manufacturing, create opportunities in mining, refining, alloy making, recycling, and advanced materials make India a competitive player in global EV and clean energy supply chains. While alternatives like ferrite motors are being explored globally, experts say rare earth-based magnets will remain indispensable across key sectors in the medium term.